Hi there. Now, for this question, we've got to use algebra to find the exact solutions of this equation here. The mod of 2x squared plus 6x minus 5 equals 5 minus 2x for 6 marks. So if you'd like to have a go at this, just give you a moment to pause the video. OK, welcome back then, if you had a go. Now, you can either fast forward at this stage, if you like, just to check the answers, or I'll take you slowly through the work solution. Now, when we get a modulus, this value in here can either be positive or it could be totally negative. So that means that we've got two possibilities here. We could either have 2x squared plus 6x minus 5, the positive version, equaling 5 minus 2x. Or we could have the negative of this, that's negative of all of 2x squared plus 6x minus 5. That equals 5 minus 2x. OK. And from here, we can just solve each of these equations and get our particular values of x. So let's start with this one. If I was to just rearrange it, we're therefore going to have 2x squared. I'll add 2x to both sides. That's going to give us 6x plus 2x, which is 8x. And take 5 from both sides here. That's going to be minus 10 equals 0. And if I just say pull out a factor of 2, we've got x squared plus 4x minus 5 equals 0. And then just factorize the quadratic factor and you get a couple of brackets there equaling 0. And what's it going to be? x there, x there, and then a plus 5 and a minus 1. OK, and that would lead on to x equaling minus 5 or x equaling 1. So we've got that set of values and with this one if I just expand the bracket we therefore have minus 2x squared and then minus 6x plus 5 equals the 5 minus 2x. And then if I rearrange this just by adding 2x squared to both sides we get 2x squared and then plus 6x minus 2x, that's 4x, and then the 5s cancel one another out. So this equals 0. Just pull out 2x as a common factor, and you've got x plus 2 equals 0. And then therefore, this leads to x equaling 0 or x equaling minus 2. So there's our answers.